Okay, guys, so it's Seth Ray back here with another video, and today I did film um, a video before this, but it was all messed up, and I probably should have tried to film it better. But anyway, so this is kind of be a help video, all that stuff. So basically, on these easy go golf carts, they're two stroke it's engines. 80s, it's yeah, 82 strokes. So basically, we had to replace the. Um, Whatchamacallit, these, the crank seal, the crank seal things. Um, so, we got the flywheel off, it was pretty hard we used, what was it again, Dad? Or, we used this bolt, Yeah. and a quarter inch yeah. e extension. Yeah, so that's what we used to take the clutch, so that's what we used to take the clutch off, but I would not recommend using a one-fourth one, I'd recommend using a three-eighths because it is thicker, because, let me show them what happened inside there. That is the one fourth <coughs> extension right there. If you guys can see it all smashed up inside the walls. But yeah, so basically, we're just gonna tell you guys, it does work because these clutches are pain. Are pain and they are on there very good. And I could tell it was probably intentionally put on there very good because there is not a single keyway on this shaft. So, um, yeah, so you want to get a three drive, and you want to get what size bolt again? That's a three quarter. Three quarter, yeah. Two and a half inch fine thread. Okay, you want to get that bolt. You're gonna want to put that. You're gonna want to um, drive that into the extension inside the clutch, and yeah, so it'll push. Don't use a quarter inch yeah. extension. Yeah, that's what happened. <laughs> so basically, this before them it. Basically, this before, was it's this. that that was that before. It this is it now. So come here. I'll Honestly, I might keep this for like a little art thing. This honestly looks pretty cool. <laughs> so, what this actually does, we tried the hydraulic pressure method, and it didn't work because of these holes down here on the clutch. Yes. Yeah, so basically, there is other ways that you can do it where you use this same bolt and so we you did. pour oil into this and you tighten this bolt down, it causes compression to pull, push the clutch off of this shaft because this clutch shaft is separate and slides onto that shaft, right? Yes, so what we ended up doing, it didn't work for us because the holes were actually leaking. So let me slide this back on. What we did was we bottomed this out all the way where the regular bolt threads into. So here's a regular bolt. It threads in down there. So we took the extension and bottomed, them, bottomed it out on the shaft. And then we tightened this bolt up on it to push on this yeah. to pop this off. Because basically what this is going to do is this is going to push in on that extension. The extension is going to then push on this um, output shaft. And then it's going to push this clutch off the shaft. Which it did work, but I would suggest using the three eighths one yeah. instead of the quarter yeah. inch. Yeah, yeah, suggest doing the three eighths one instead of the quarter inch. Now we're not saying, guys, that this is the best way, but, but it's, it's the one way of the, it worked for us. Yeah, it's the way it worked for us, especially since we have those oil holes to where we can't use oil because it just pour out. But anyway, yeah, guys. So um, that's just a little instructional video. Um. I'll probably do a couple more, of course, if we do more stuff like this. But, yeah. So, basically, um, use the, what's this called again? Three-quarter inch, two-and-a-half inch fine thread bolt. Yeah, use that. And you use a, not not a one-fourth drive. You use a one, you use a three-eighths three drive extension because this is what happens. Now, guys, look. Now, when we put this in the shaft, we start hammering on it, the one-fourth one. This is how it looked like before, you know, completely, co completely fine extension. And this is the aftermath of that exact one we put in there. Yeah, I didn't think it was going to have that much pressure. Yeah, we did not think it was going to have that much pressure. So we recommend using a 3 8 one because it's more thicker and will work better. But yeah, basically, so yeah, that is it. Um, And yeah, guys, make sure you guys subscribe. Hit the notification bell, drop a like, and comment down below what you guys want to see me do for any new videos or anything like that. If you guys want more instructional videos, honestly, I think I'm going to start doing...
go-karting vlogs, you know, tractor, mini bike vlogs, big international tractor vlogs, and if we keep this thing when it runs, some golf cart vlogs. But anyway, yeah, guys, so I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.